Hey everyone, welcome back to Sekiro, uh, where I had to kind of back out of this dialogue here with Emma because she has the cure or whatever for the dragon sickness rot. Is it called? Yeah, it's called dragon rot. So we're gonna get through this quickly and um, yeah, I'll see you on the other side when we cure this. The thing is, she just gives you one of these, but again, as I said, it's good to like stack up on this whenever you can. Cool, so what we're gonna do is we are going to restore this. Uh, normally you want to do this, uh, you don't really want to leave Dragon Rot hanging because NPCs can actually die. Don't really like none of the actually important <laughs> ones can die. Uh, they're not that crazy. Uh, but some of the like minor NPCs can you know kick the busket as they say or the bucket. I combine bucket and bus basket um, but never mind that. We're gonna go back to the Hirata audience chamber. I thought about whether to go for the the bull or whether to go for Lady Butterfly. The thing is if I fail on Lady Butterfly, which there is quite a high chance I can just go do the bull. I don't like... No, I like Lady Butterfly as a boss, but I'm not a big fan of the bull. Kinda never really cracked what the fuck you're actually supposed to do against it. <clears throat> but hey, here's hoping. And this... This is like stuck in like ultimate purgatory because when you're trying for the boss here, uh, this dude dies a shit ton. And here we have the homie, the homie from the future, Inosuke or whatever his name is. See, that would be the smart thing to do, wouldn't it? To get a snap seed. I think he actually gives you one, doesn't he? Anyways, welcome back everyone, once again. I'm... It's like I'm starting off this episode, but... I kind of am, because... Yeah, we're back with Sekiro. It didn't actually take me like a week to post another episode this time around. Which it usually does. I don't know man, I get like distracted throughout the week. Plus it's been like mad busy here, not even with work. Um, we were, were like renovating our um, house a little bit. We, ha we have like a balcony slash terrace. And it's like really in need of some repairs so that's what's been happening throughout the week she's cool again I like this boss <coughs> but man is she a tough cookie Nice little standoff here. Do they ever explain lore masters? Come on. Why she attacks you? She's just being an asshole. Cool. And I already fucked up. Okay, I should have all the necessary, like, moves here. Yeah, because she only... she doesn't really do stabs. Um... 
fuck. And this is the one. Yep, this is where you can like kind of do some serious damage. Yeah, and she's like in the air like that. Not good. I was close too. And I was thinking, you know, whether... Whether to heal. Uh, I should have. I mean, phase two isn't easy, so... Come on, there we go. Like fucking hell. Pop a pellet too. Should I do Ongo? I think I'm gonna do Ongo Sugar. Oh yeah, she does the fucking Prince Lothric. Prince Lothric classic. Switch back to your healing bitch. How did I avoid that? How the hell did I avoid that? Seriously. She just drum, jump straight up. I don't know if I have the... I don't think I have the jump... Like, super counter, you know. You know which one I'm talking about. This is the one. I think you just gotta, like, fucking... What do you have to do here? I think you just have to, like, last... Until it goes away. After a while, after a while, she converts them, yeah, to projectiles. The only thing that's shitty about this is she converts them to projectiles, and then she can move like immediately. I really hope I have an extra resurrection here. If I don't, I'm gonna be... Get away! How am I this low on HP again? Ah, oh, fuck. I'm gonna... My last healing item. To be fair, she doesn't have much left. She's dead. She's dead. First time's the charm. Holy shit, that was actually really good. Maybe I do know how to play this game. Maybe I do. Without getting too arrogant. Hello. I just beat Lady Butterfly first time. 
Nice. That's the easiest thing I've ever done. What the hell is that? Oh, yeah, this is the thing that gives you more resurrection. Oh, fuck. I'm I got a little bit too excited. I'm clipping my audio like a motherfucker. Um, I should turn that shit down a little bit. Oh, well. Whatever. Maybe it's gonna sound like shit. But I can fix that. Oh, shit. And this, you know, because this takes place in the past, Lore Master Mr. Sketchhead coming up here. This is how we end up at the beginning. We like get stabbed, fail our mission, commit Sudoku, you know how it goes. It's the ninja life. How the fuck is he lifting that? <laughs> and that's how we get the resurrection, if I remember correctly. Resurrection! I gotta say that every single time. All right, we're back. Two skill points. Two and a, almost three. They have been indeed. But not who stabbed us. I wonder who, who it could have been. Who was that tricky motherfucker? I'm sure we're never gonna find out. Never. It's our little secret or something. Oh yeah, because he's the big demon. This is one fucking enemy I'm sure is hell not gonna be fighting. He's like a super boss if you don't know, spoiler alert. Oh yeah, you can give him a... You can get him drunk. Can I do an upgrade? Spring-loaded firecracker, that's actually good. And what do we need? We need the materials and the money. I don't think I have a... You know what, let's give him a sake. Let's get wasted. Sake is good. He's like, don't mind if I do. Isn't this guy Russian by any chance? Or Hungarian? Either or. Maybe I'll go for a sake after this. No, I'm not. Oh yeah, there is like major secret lore here, if you don't know, he did it for my sake, right? Man, I'm funny today. Cool, that conversation died down a little bit after a while. You can also give the sake to her. Oh. 
武士殿に渡してくださいAlright, it's time to slide into the DMs of Ashina Castle again and actually move on. Okay, let's get going here. We might as well, like, you know, not fuck around. We're pretty powerful here. Probably don't even need the on go. Something no oh it's the doggos that noticed me. I did mention right about the dogs in this game. And animals in general, like like this dude. Peter would have a field day with him, and I think I've made that joke before, but seriously, like this fool kills so many animals in this game that it's kind of insane. Oh yeah, this is a sneaky entrance. You get some treasure for it as well. Some money. Okay. Oh yeah, they're talking about the bull here. These two fools are gonna die. I have unfortunate news. Whoops, you're dead. Are you gonna get Mik? Oh, you could have gotten Mikirid, but it's like whatever. I think there's like more shit here, like in treasure wise, but also one of those things. I'm not sure I want to fight that. I mean, whoops, yeah, ignore that, guys. Ignore the noise. Nothing is going on. Alright, we have another boss. Sort of. Yeah, the blazing bull. The, I hate this thing. In fact, you know what I'm gonna. This is what maybe the best defense is a good offense. Is it fuck? Isn't there one that's supposed to increase, reduces posture damage? I swear there could there used to be one or there is one. I just don't think we have it yet. There is one that increases attack. And that's the one I like. Anyways, this boss is fucked up. Cause it like just like crazily swings around. And you don't even know what the fuck is going on half the time. This is as I'm demonstrating here. Oh, 
like sprinting from it and it's fucking difficult to hit too Ugh. god i hate you i hate you i know you're just like a random ass bull these assholes like trapped here when it's like you know what can you do the problem is this is the problem I mean, it, at least it doesn't have a lot of HP. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> okay. Get the hell away from it. I think like a couple of well-timed... Fuck. That was not a well-timed Shinobi Firecracker. In fact, that was the exact opposite of a well-timed shinobi firecracker. Okay, it's freaking out. Okay, cool. Could have been closer to it a little bit. Okay, now it's freaking out. That's its death, right? Yeah. Sorry, bull. I'm gonna put you out of your misery here. God, I hate this boss. But, at least when you come here after beating like Harada Estates and whatever, uh, you can just kind of like brute force this. Which is, I feel like, the way to deal with this. What a bitch is. Oh, I was trying to be really impressive there. And I am really impressive. Sucks for you guys. That's what you get for torturing that poor bull. Says the man who has just shuriken like half a dozen dogs in the previous episode. Hey crazy lady. In the first mention of Senpu Temple. Senpai Temple. She has the best voice actor in this entire game. Somebody's smoking their bong too there. Man, these stoners are everywhere. Should I just get this one? I think I'm just gonna get this one too. Yeah, fuck it. If I have the skills for it. Yo, so there are several ways we can go here. Uh, I think I'm gonna go on this side path here. Honestly, there isn't even that much I need to or can cut out from this episode so far. It's been like smooth sailing. This is where we started off. If you didn't catch. I don't know which one, which enemy they're talking about here. Should he always give you like hints to like bosses and shit? Hey, bros. Sorry for you being dead. Come on. <laughs> That's what I wanted. The seventh attempt is always successful. Oh, there's the dude with the bell. I don't think... Actually, am I in the wrong place? I am in the wrong place, aren't I? Shit, I'm already 27 minutes in. And I, again, I don't have a lot to cut out from here. That's a Tupac holograms.
There is a lot of people there. I think that's where we want to go. By the way. Yeah, this is where we're going. I've made an executive decision. Such a bullshit term. I don't know why. I keep using it for some reason, but ignore me. I'm like... You know, babbling on about random shit. Hold on, this is not where I want to go either. Fuck, where is that place that leads to that side hoe temple? Nice. We kind of want these items, not gonna lie. Yeah, you know which one I'm talking about. It's this one, right? I think this is it. Yeah, cause you, I can always tell because there is a sculpture on the other side. Nice. Just ignore that. We just rest at the little statue here. Sorry, doggo. Sorry, doggo. They're not even like fucking demon dogs like in Dark Souls or something. They're just like regular ass. Damn, Sekiro. You're dark. And we can go down there, but there's really no point. This path, I'm always going to remember. Definitely not because I've done it like 50 fucking times. It's definitely not the case. Fuck. I messed up. How the hell did I block that? If you don't know, you can block... Um, you do have the ability to block um, spear whatevers. It's just very difficult to do. Oh yeah, and you, you can get up there, you just need that late game ability, don't you? What's the third enemy that has me noticed? Oh yeah, there's a fool there. Okay. Who's now dead? God, me and stealth today are not, not exactly best buds. I'm like kind of mad fucking this up. Just ignore me. Turn around. You're dumb as hell and blind as hell. So just, you know, act like it. Oh, when you turn your back, you're going to have a bad time. Is that the mini boss? That's not the mini boss. God damn it. Backing away like that, I don't like it. <sighs> 
animation saved me. Thank you. I mean, it's like good combat training to fight these things. God, that move is sick. And you're like fucking little nightgown. However, what's not sick is that mini boss waiting for us up there. Uh, that dude is mad difficult, and that's gonna put our Mikiri skills to the test and our skills in general. So and we have that to look forward to in the next episode of Sekiro. I know how to clickbait. Not even clickbait, but you know. I'm like a good daytime network drama show. I know how to keep the audience hooked. So I'm gonna go ahead and wrap up this episode here as we inch towards this mini boss. I feel like this was a very successful episode. Uh, I feel like that cannot be denied. And we'll see whether our kind of positivity gets shattered here when I try to kill that dude. Yeah, it's not gonna be easy. If you did enjoy this episode of Sekiro, everyone, make sure to give it a like, comment, and subscribe. As always, turn on post notifications to stay up to date on my content. Take care, everyone. Hope you enjoyed. Again, peace out and see you next time. Goodbye.